Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV in Grand Rapids, Michigan. And today I'm here to tell you all about the 2018 Sonic 230 VRL. It's a great couples coach, fairly lightweight, it's a little over 4,000 pounds. Let's start right up front here, we'll make our way around and then we'll head on in. So I always like when manufacturers do this on travel trailers, they give you a power tongue jack right from the manufacturer. Just makes it a heck of a lot easier to hook up and disconnect from the tow vehicle. Right behind that is your propane tank cover with two 20 pound tanks. Of course, easy to get at, just undo the thumb screws and lift up the door there. Right behind that, you have your rails for your battery box. And coming up the front is black diamond plating. That will help protect the front end from some of the rocks and debris that get thrown up by your tow vehicle. That way it hits the diamond plate and not the beautiful fiberglass here on the front end. Speaking of the fiberglass, one of the cool things about the Sonic construction, this is one piece fiberglass from the front all the way up onto the roof and down the back. Couple big advantages to that. Uh, and most of them have to do with water penetration, which when you're talking about your ceiling and water, you want all the advantages you can have. So by having that one piece roof, that means you have less seams going across. As we all know, the less seams and holes we have in our roof, the less chance for water entry. Also, because the natural curve of the Sonic, that makes your water run to the front and the back of the RV, so it doesn't sit here and drop down on your campsite. Again, it naturally runs to the front and back, which again, less seams, good thing for water. So you come right over here, we look at our pass-through storage. Couple things here as well. You will see it has a covered hinge, so that way you don't have a bunch of rust coming down your door. You have the nice close there for the latch. You'll also see right here it has a magnet, so that way you don't have to worry about having a little plastic tab to have it snap off or anything. Nice strong magnet to hold it up. You take a look in there, you can see again, this is a pass-through, both uh, the same size door on both sides there. So whether you're getting in from the door side or the off door side, it's just as easy to get your equipment out. And you also have an LED light in there in case you need to uh, access whatever is in there at night. Now if we take a look right up top, you can see the power awning. It is a huge power awning on here. Just touch a button to have that roll out, same thing to go right back in. And it has an LED light strip, so that way at night, you can have light by just the flip of a switch. You don't have to get up there and worry about hanging up your Christmas lights. Getting into the 230 is quite simple as well. You'll see you have two steps here. The first one is nice and low to the ground. So if you have bad knees, you won't struggle getting into the 230. If you like to watch TV while you're outside, great. You have TV hookups right here. You can see a spot for your cable or satellite there, as well as electric connections right underneath. And of course, you can obviously plug anything you want in there, whether it's cell phones, you have a table out here with a crock pot, whatever else you want. Uh, if you want to listen to music, not an issue either. You have two speakers right here. Those are controlled by the multimedia center inside, but it is Bluetooth capable. So if you're sitting out here with a smart device, you can connect to that via Bluetooth, be able to control your music from right outside. Take a look at the wheels, you'll see they are aluminum alloy wheels. So one, those look really nice. Two, that will help prevent rust or corrosion. And then you have nitrogen filled tires there too. Let's come around to the back side here. A couple things back here. One, you do have a spare tire that comes with the Sonic. That is obviously mounted on your bumper. And you have the spare tire cover, which not only shows off the fancy logo here, but also helps protect the tire from the elements. You take a look right underneath, you will see a propane quick connect. For those of you that like to cook outside, you can put your grill either on the side here, right in the back, be able to plug in that propane quick connect. That will feed off your two 20 pound bottles up front rather than having to bring these small ones with you camping. You see right up here, the unit is prepped for a backup camera. So if you want one, that is nice and easy to install. And then right back here, this is pretty neat too. This unit is prepped for solar. So if you want solar, all I have to do is buy the Furion panels, plug it in right here, and it will, go ahead, it will go ahead and trickle charge the battery for you. And then cable and satellite inlets are right back here as well. Last thing of note on the off door side, 30 amp detachable power cord right there. Your uh, city water connection here, this is your black tank flush. If you're not familiar with that, what that does instead of having to take a hose and put it down your toilet to wash out your black tank, 
Now I can take that same hose, screw it right in there, and that uh, the black tank has sprayers built in, it will wash it right out for you. And it's a really convenient spot because it's right next to everything else uh, that you'll be hooking up. Outside shower there with hot and cold, and then your termination for your gray and your black is right down there. Welcome to the inside of the 2018 Sonic 230 VRL. Start right over here on the kitchen. So you have the seamless countertops, which is a nice upgrade over the T mold, and it's a nice big countertop too. You especially have good prep space because they give you the sink top cover here as well as the cooktop cover. If I remove the cover, that will reveal your double bowl sink, larger bowl there on the left with a high rise faucet. Right behind the sink is a window, so that way you get some natural light during the day. It also gives you a good view uh, out the window right at your campsite. If you take a look right over here, you'll see there is an electrical outlet, so if you need to plug in a coffee maker, blender, or anything, that is the spot to do it. Good storage underneath here as well. You can take a look right there, see a little bit of storage, and that does go back quite a ways. You also have two full extension ball bearing drawers here, so you have plenty of room for your silverware, serving utensils, big spoons, things like that. Uh, right down here, you see you have storage all through here as well as right down there, furnace there of course too. If we make our way back up top, take a look at this storage, big pantry storage up here. Uh, I really like that, you know, it's nice to have a place to store a lot of food, especially in a smaller camper. Then right over here is your convection microwave. So this is the oven and microwave in one, which is why we're able to have so much storage down below here underneath the cooktop. And I really like convection, it's easier to clean uh, and it cooks faster than your conventional oven too. Underneath that is your hood with the light and fan and the two burner cooktop is recessed. You have the glass top here again, so you can use that as prep space. Fold it up, doubles as a backsplash and that will reveal your two burner cooktop there. Making our way back a little bit further here, this is pretty neat too, right on the end, uh, this is what they call a tech box. So it looks just like your cabinet end, but you open it up, you see you have an electrical outlet in there as well as a dual USB port. So it gives you a great place just to charge some of those electronic devices. Now this is the main uh, place you'll be hanging out, uh, your main seating area right back here. Of course you have your sofa along this wall. This is a jackknife sofa. So if you take a look here underneath, you'll see you have great storage there. Perfect spot to put all your blankets, pillows, things like that. And this does fold down into a bed for additional sleeping space. You have a big window there too, which lets in a lot of natural light and good storage right up top here. You can see that. Um, of course, LED lights throughout the coach, you can see that here too, which is a big deal, especially if you're doing boondocking, because they don't put out near the heat and use a fraction of the energy. Windows all around back here. Uh, on this back wall, this is your multimedia center right here. So uh, this is your radio and CD player. This unit is uh, Bluetooth capable. And what you will see is it has these right here. This is a DVD player, so if you wanna watch TV, there's a little spot right here you can run those up, put a TV back here, and you're able to plug your DVD player right into it. And then you have the dinette. This, of course, is where you'll be doing, uh, the, obviously, all of your eating, and you also have the big window there so you can enjoy the view during the morning while you're eating breakfast, having your cup of coffee. And then this does drop down into a bed, too. So both of these can be sleeping spaces. Another thing you will see, there is an electrical outlet right here. So you can use that, uh, whether, you know, for any appliances in the kitchen, or if you need to work on like a laptop, tablet, something like that, you can plug into it right there. Uh, and again, that is the black diamond um, interior. The other thing I do want to mention about these cushions, these are reversible. So if you get tired of this black diamond pattern, you want to flip it over and have leather, you can just flip them over just like this, reverse the place, and you're able to do that. The bottoms will flip too, which is pretty cool. That way you can have a leather bottom in case you have uh, you know, kids or guests and you don't want the cloth to get dirty. And then rounding out the kitchen over here, this is the Norcold fridge freezer combo. You can see you have plenty of space in here. This unit runs off both propane and electric and also has automatic switchover. If you take a look right up at the top here above me, this is your AC. So this is uh, definitely a great way to cool the coach off. If you don't want to open up the windows, have a cross breeze on those really hot days, the AC will do the trick. And then right here you have a big skylight to let in a lot of natural light during the day. The bathroom has a foot flush lever toilet with plenty of legroom all the way around. 
you'll see right up here you have a nice big vent fan so you easily help get all the moisture out of the bathroom. Mirrored medicine cabinet there with storage behind it. Down below that, your sink top, big countertop there, which is nice. You also see you have a cutout on one side, so you have a big place to put a trash can and a little bit of storage underneath the sink. Then right over here is your shower. Uh, you'll see the shower does have uh, glass doors on a roller track, which is really nice. That way all the water stays right down in the shower basin. Then you'll notice your hand wand as well as the big skylight up top. In the nose of the Sonic is the master bedroom. You see you have a walk around queen bed here. There is storage underneath. Also right here you have a curtition so you are able to close that off for additional privacy if you have guests sleeping in the back. Window on both sides allows for a nice cross breeze. And on both sides of the bed you have wardrobe. You can see the hanging rod going across there. Across the top here you also have additional storage. You'll see that is strut supported so it's just easy one hand operation. And then underneath you have two LED reading lights, nice shelves up here in the corner. You see an electrical outlet on one side and then dual USB on the other for charging different types of uh, mobile devices. Lastly, right up here is your TV connection. So if you do want a TV in the bedroom, it's easy to have that installed. But all right, folks, that wraps it up. Again, this is a 2018 Sonic 230 VRL. This one is in the black diamond interior. If you're interested in this RV and you'd like price and availability, I recommend you give us a call here at American RV, or you can take a look at our website, which is AmericanRV.com. Thanks again for watching. I'm Ian Baker, and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom.